dear learners how are you i hope all of you are in hell and hearty we are all in an alarming situation covid 19 has grasped the whole world you are detached from your classroom study for a long time it is hampering your academic progress badly so shiraz gons online school has arranged online classes for you i am abul kalam azad assistant professor in english of the government college welcoming you to join the class i hope if you to join the class attentively you will be highly benefited dear learners today i am going to discuss a passage from your textbook you know that you will have three passages in the first passage you will have five multiple choice questions and five short questions where you will get 15 marks for five multiple choice questions you will have five marks and for five short questions you will have 10 marks and in the second passage you will have to transfer information according to the instruction the transfer mission of instruction may be in complete sentence or in in flow chart third in the third passage you have to summarize the third passage in your own language in the second passage you will have 10 marks and in the third passage you will have 10 marks today I am going to discuss a passage from Unit on a lesson on dear learners. To solve the problems of the passages, you will have to go through the passages again and again. If you do not make out the meaning of the passages, if you do not understand the passages, it will not be possible for you to answer the questions successfully. So. you will have to go to go through the passages uh, again and again to understand the meaning of the passages then you can attempt the answers today's passage is about a great man in the world the passage is about nelson mandela the great leader of south africa nelson mandela is not only the great leader of south africa but he is the leader of all the oppressed people throughout the world he is considered the leader of all the oppressed and deprived people throughout the world he struggled for his life against apartheid it was a government policy of racial segregation of the then uh, south african government South, South African minority government. The then government separated the uh, majority black people of South Africa from the minority uh, white people of that country. The majority black people were deprived of all basic human rights. They were behaved inhumanly. so nelson mandela the great black leader how to put an end of such kind of apartheid we wanted to uh, wanted to make the black people free from the shackles of apartheid so he struggled throughout his life to remove apartheid from south africa and so the then south african government he was then he was thrown behind the prison bar for about 30 years but the government could not break his spirit of liberating his people at last he became successful 
He became the first black president of South Africa. Now, go through the take your open your textbook, go through the passages attentively, and try to uh, answer the questions. At first, we have five multiple choice questions. We have five alternative answers. You have to choose the best one from the answers. Now, I am writing the questions, question and answer. Number one A. In number one A, we have five multiple choice questions. Now, I am writing the questions and answer, uh, answers. Nelson Mandela. is considered as a now I alternative answers number one as an icon of love number two symbol of destruction number four Number A, National Day is considered as an icon of love, an emblem of democracy, a symbol of destruction, an emblem of peace and harmony. In this, in this four alternative answers, you will have to choose the best answer from all the options. If we go through the passages, we see that he is an emblem of peace and harmony. Number one, number three, number one, number two, number one, and I could have love, love also correct partially, and if it of democracy, it's also partially correct, but the most correct answer will be, and if in a frame of peace and harmony, it's the best answer, best answer. so you have to answer, and in frame of peace and harmony, it will be the best answer, you have to answer, and in frame of peace and harmony. Yes, Mandela is considered as an emblem of peace and harmony. Next question, number two. What does the word shackles? meaning of the word shackles. There are four alternative meanings. Number one, ring. Number two, fetters. Number three, freedom. And number four, bar. It's only the simple meaning of the word shackles. 
according to the passage you have to give the meaning of the word shackles. Shackles means that according to the passage we find the meaning fetters. Fetters. That means simple. Simple. What does the word shackles mean? According to the passage we find the meaning fetters. That means simple. Fetters will be the correct answer of this question. Now, number C. He was kept in prison for alternative answer. Number one about twenty yards about thirty yards number three less than twenty yards. Answers of the question. He was kept in prison for how many years? You have to collect information from the passes. To go through the pass, uh, uh, well, you will be able to collect information. About 20 years, about 30 years, less than 20 years, more than 30 years. About three decades. Three decades means 30 years. About 30 years. The correct answer. Will be about 30 years. We will write down the answer. He was kept in prison for about 30 years. It will be the correct answer. Now, next multiple choice question. What does the word item in the passage? Mean. What does the word icon in the passage mean? There are four alternative answers and, and you will have to choose the best one. Number one. Design. Number two. Fashion. Number three. Simple. Number four. It is season. There are four alternative question answers, and you need to select the best answer from the four alternative. What does the word icon in the best mean? According to the basis, the meaning of the word icon is symbol. Symbol. The meaning of the word is symbol. Now, last part which is question. What does the word apartheid apartheid in the passes? Refer to. What does the word apartheid in the passage refer to? Number one. Satisfaction. Number two. Satisfaction. Number three. Socialization number four 
discrimination. You have to choose the best result from four alternatives satisfaction, dissatisfaction, socialization, and discrimination. Apart it means separation, that means discrimination. From the basis, we can find the meaning apart it discrimination. This is how we can choose the best answer of five questions. You will have four alternative answers and you will have to choose the best answer, not partial answer, the best answer among the four. The first question actually is considered as necessary to be your producer of life, an icon of love, and an epitome of democracy, both of the history, a symbol of destruction, and an emblem of peace and harmony, shanti and shohar de kodi history. From the basis, we can collect the best information. He is a symbol of, he is an emblem of, symbol of peace and harmony. Shanti hum, shohar de kodi history. So the best answer will be, Nesmita is considered as an emblem of peace and harmony. The next question, what does the word shackles mean? The meaning of the word shackles, shackle means fetters, ring, fetters, prison and bar. And the best answer will be fetters, string code. Ring and prison, paragon, bar, prison, bar. The correct answer will be patterns. He was kept in prison for number C. He was kept in prison for about 20 years, about 30 years, less than 30 years, more than 30 years. If we collect the information from the passage, we find that he was prison in the uh, uh, for about three decades, that means about 30 years. What does the word icon in the passage mean? Here yeah, we have four alternative meaning design, fashion, symbol, and discount. But we know that icon means icon, icon means symbol. In the last question, what does the word apartheid in the passage refer to? Apartheid both the passage is that satisfaction of the dissatisfaction, dissatisfaction of the state, socialization of the economy. Discrimination, which is called which level? From the basis, we find that apartheid means discrimination. This is how we have to choose the best answer from four alternatives. Now, in the first cases, we have to answer five short questions. Now, I am trying to write down the questions, and you will try your best to answer the questions. When you will write down the short question, you must collect information from the passes and you will have to write down the answer in your own language. You can take help from the question. You, uh, you will try your best to make the question into answer. But you must collect information from the passes. And you, will, uh, you must keep in mind that the answer will be short and in brief. Now, the first question, I am writing the first question. He who was Nelson Mandela. Here is a simple question. Who was Nelson Mandela? All of we know him very well. That he was the great leader of South Africa. He was the great black leader of South Africa. Who was Nelson Mandela? From W S U, we have to give the information about Nelson Mandela, about the ability of. You will have to give the information of Nelson Mandela. You will have to give the ability of Nelson Mandela. To write down the answer, at first we will have to set up subject Nelson Mandela. Mandela, the part was then. We will collect information of information from the passes. 
Nelson Mandela was from the basis we know that was the first black president of South Africa. Nelson Mandela was the first black president of South Africa. Nelson Mandela was the first black president of South Africa. You need not elaborate that, sir. Now, we can try the second question. Why did Nelson Mandela struggle throughout his life. Why did Nelson Mandela struggle throughout his life? The first question was, who was Nelson Mandela? Nelson Mandela question. From the passage, we find that Nelson Mandela was the first black president of South Africa. Nelson Mandela was South Africa, Prothom, Istanbul president. You can write down any more sentence, more, sent more sentences to complete the answer. The second question, why did Nelson Mandela struggle throughout his life? Can Nelson Mandela as you want? Shangam Why? The answer of why is adverb of cause, adverb of reason. So, at first we have to uh, collect information from the passes. Then we can change the question into answer. We can attempt to make the question into answer, correcting information from the passes. Then we can try to change, first we can try to change the sentence into answer again. At first we have to set up subject. Nelson Mandela as the sentence, uh, question is in past tense, so your answer should be in past tense. Nelson Mandela, you will change the sentence into a struggle. Now, Nelson Mandela struggled. Now we can collect information from the passes to remove apartheid from South Africa throughout his life. Throughout his life, throughout his life, to remove apartheid. South Africa. Nelson Mandela struggled throughout his life to remove apartheid from South Africa. Dokkin Africa, one of our Dukkarat Jano, the Ajivan, Shonar Gore Nelson Mandela struggled throughout his life to remove apartheid from South Africa. Or Nelson Mandela struggled to remove apartheid from South Africa throughout his life. That's fine. Next answer, next question. When was he awarded the Nobel Prize? When was he awarded the Nobel Prize? The answer will be at half of time. So at first you try your best to change the question into an assertive sentence. When was he awarded the Nobel Prize? We know that he was awarded the Nobel Prize in 1900. Um, now, at first, we have to start the answer from the subject. He was awarded. The Nobel Prize. Now, 
by himself of when we retired from the cases. He was awarded the Hall Prize in 1993. We have collected information from the cases. He was awarded the Hall Prize in 1993. We have changed the question in and then we have collected the information from the cases. The next question. What was the policy of the then government of South Africa? What was the policy of the then government of South Africa? We have to collect the information for the passes. What was the policy? The policy was racial segregation. The, then, the policy of the then government of South Africa was racial segregation. You can send the question to SRT. The policy of the then government of South Africa. The policy of the then Government of South Africa was racial segregation. The policy of the then government of South Africa was racial segregation. The government separated the uh, majority black people from the minority white people. The next and the last question how long was Nelson Mandela from behind the bar. How long was Nelson Mandela from behind the bar? Nelson Mandela ki kotho din karagare thak 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 How long was Nelson Mandela from behind the bar? You can change the question. We start.